Because we live in a very turbulent era, there are people who live in great danger or live in a very hard chaos. We can also understand that these turbulences or this chaos in which people are living can come from a karmic inheritance, from a hard tikkun. Then to avoid situations of extreme danger and to remove the judgments that come from karmic inheritance from previous lives, we have the combination of these six letters that come from the Anabe Hoach, which is Aleph, Bet, Gimel, Yud, Tav, and Zadi, which are in reality the initials to six names of God. It comes from a poem written by Rabbi Nehunia ben Akana, of blessed memory. Ana bechoach gedulat yimenecha tatir sirura. But the true names of God are Adidiadon, Bahidiadon, Gavidiadon, Yikpaya, Telamya, Sefanya. And the codes of the alphabet of Metatron that corresponds to these letters and that are the initials of the names that I just pronounced, but that shouldn't be pronounced, but only for education's sake. That is, you say it once in period, and that's because they discharge tremendous energy. But this world is suffering so much that we have to pronounce them. So you're going to think Aleph, Bet, Gimel, Yud, Tav, and Zadi, but you will visualize Aleph, Bet, Gimel, Yud, Tav, and Zadi in the alphabet of Metatron. So when we meditate in Hebrew, the Aleph, the Bet, the Gimel, the Yud, the Tav, and the Zadi, we imagine that we are igniting them like candles. But the alphabet of Metatron, we don't ignite them like a candle. Rather, the letters shine into our souls. That is, the shine directly enters into us, or the light shines directly into us. And it doesn't enter the brain, the heart, and the liver. But it impacts our aura and penetrates as a whole within us. And this energizes our aura to the point that it takes away the hard judgments that come from a karmic inheritance. There are things that can be removed with prayer. But when it comes from a karma, from past lives, it's much more difficult. What we are going to meditate is the second row. This, the first row is so that you know what it corresponds to. Metatron is linked to the name of God Shaddai, which is linked to our patriarch, Yosef HaSadiq, who is the door of the blessings for this world. So therefore, we're going to open the six doors of blessings that corresponds to these names of God so that even if we have them closed due to a karmic inheritance, they will open. Thanks to this meditation that we're going to do today. Okay, so let's go ahead and start the meditation and sit up straight with our feet parallel on the floor, the hands on the palms facing up, over our knees. Let's go ahead and breathe deeply three times so that we may relax. Now we visualize ourselves in a star of David, color of gold, we are a white column of light energy. In front of us, there is another star of David, color of gold. We visualize the second row, which is the alphabet of Metatron. For those that do not know them, you can open your eyes and then close them. Now we see Metatron's letter that corresponds to the Aleph. We see the second letter that corresponds to the bet. The third letter that corresponds to the gimel. 
the fourth letter that corresponds to the Yud, the fifth that corresponds to the Tav, and the sixth that corresponds to the Zadi. These, these letters begin to shine of an intense white. They begin to radiate light. They transfer themselves into light and they are transferred from the Star of David that acted as a screen to our Star of David, but in block all at once. The light goes inside of us, feeding our aura and cleaning our aura that was bringing a very bad, hard tikkun of karmic inheritance and it cleans our aura to the point that it opens six channels of blessings, avoiding danger, avoiding great anguish. And now we are a column of light. We start shining a very intensive light. We make a circle with the earth in the middle and we see how this intense light that emanates from us penetrates the earth's aura it permeates the earth's aura. It penetrates everything. Humans, animals, fish, vegetation, minerals. Enters the enters inside and penetrates the earth. Penetrates all beings inside and outside the earth and cleans the karmic tikkun. And we are healing the world in all of its strata. In this way, there comes a great forgiveness, a pardon of all karma. Metatron, Sandalphon, and Mashiach come down, and I leave you in free speech with them. We take three deep breaths. And we open our eyes.